Good afternoon. Uh, this is Arun Kushar from Vidya Excel Concepts Private Limited. First and foremost, sabhi need aspirants ko hum logon ki taraf se bahut bahut shubh kamnaye. All the best for tomorrow. Keep your head cool and uh, give your need in the proper way. I have come to share a few uh, aspects about MBBS 2025 and of different states. I will cover uh, mostly few states where people are confused. Number one state among that is Chhattisgarh. Chhattisgarh is a state where people get confused that what kind of marks are needed. Chhattisgarh has got uh, five private colleges mostly and uh, Chhattisgarh has got a 50% domicile status. 50% of the seats are reserved for domicile. 33% is for management outside means uh, from any other state you can apply in Chhattisgarh and 17% is for uh, NRI. Now uh, for securing a seat in Chhattisgarh the mark should be in the range of 450 to 550 mostly and uh, if you are opting for NRI quota the definitely low marks will also uh, be fine and you can count on that. Second comes MP. Now this is a very important state I am talking about today. Um, uh, MP is a state where outsiders can apply in 15% management quota but that is from the second round that is from the second round and people have a uh, wrong concept about uh, MP that only NRI quota is applicable in MP no that is not the case okay I will clear this confusion that if you see that if you mark if you have enough marks means 550 and above you can also apply in 15% management quota in the same fees in which the MP domiciles are allowing Say for instance, MP domicile, uh, a college in MP has got a fees of 9 lakhs. You can also apply for that 9 lakh fees. You are eligible. But from the second round. MP is the only state where you would be uh, eligible for the second round in NRI also. Rest everywhere you can apply in NRI from the very first round, including Maharashtra. Now Maharashtra is another important state where private colleges, outsiders are not allowed in any private colleges except NRI quota. In Maharashtra, if you apply, you have to apply for only DIM quota, right? Now uh, comes Karnataka. Karnataka, you can apply. It's an uh, open state. You can apply for 15% management quota in GMP, general merit quota. If you have the number, you can apply for that, where the fees will be 11 lakhs uh, per annum. And apart from that, if you have low fees, then you can obviously opt for other quota, which is equivalent to NRI quota. Now, Karnataka is the only state where you can apply in NRI quota without NRI documents because the NRI quota fees and the other quota fees are the same. You have to apply through KEA. This is one important state. And uh, then we come out West Bengal. West Bengal is a open state. There are a lot of good colleges in West Bengal. A lot of options are there. But please don't fall in false traps who claim that you will get a seat in West Bengal in the range of 70 lakhs, 60 lakhs. It is not possible. The minimum fees in West Bengal would start from 80 lakhs. It will go to 1.1 CR except KPC because KPC has got, got, got a management quota fees which is in the range of 72 lakhs, 72 lakhs something which is which was in the last year or this year maybe the fees will increase so we will inform you that but for that you need a very very high, high marks in the range of 590 plus and uh, next comes uh, I2 City is there, I2 City is a very good college, Jagannath Gupta is a very good college, iCare is a very good college then uh, uh, Goridevi is a very good college. There are a lot of, uh, Santhanikathan is an option for you, you people, if you are opting for West Bengal. Then there are new colleges like Zakir Hussain is there, like Krishnanagar Medical College, JMN is there. And these are the options in West Bengal. Now coming to Delhi. Delhi, there is only one team college, you know Himsar, which is uh, Hamdat Institute of Medical Science and Research Center. So for Himsar, uh, if you want to opt for Himsar, then you have to think of a very high cutoff, which is about 500, 550 plus. Mostly, it's a minority college, Muslim minority. Now coming to uh, Gurugram. Gurugram, SGT Gurugram is a very good option. In Gurugram, you will have uh, NC College, then uh, World School Jajja, Alphala Dhaj, Adesh Kurukshetra. These are all very good options in Haryana. Then coming to Uttarakhand, there are uh, Himalayan Institute of Medical Science, Guru Ram Das. It's all these colleges uh, will be in the range of Haryana and Uttarakhand will be in the range of 85 lakhs to 1.1 CR, be it NRI. And uh, one thing I for forgot to mention that NRI quota in Chhattisgarh is nearly in Haryana and Chhattisgarh are the cheapest, which is in the range of 1.1 to 1.2 CR. Apart from that, you won't get NRI quota, which is so cheap. 
It is mostly above 1.4, 1.5 everywhere, near every state. Now Maharashtra, I don't need to say anything. There are a lot of good deemed colleges like D.Y. Patil is there, Bharati Vidyapit is there, Pravare Loni is there, uh, then uh, MGM Aurangabad is there, Symbiosis for Women is there. So, so these are the options and uh, depending on marks and depending on your budget, you can fit in Maharashtra also. Then comes uh, Andhra and uh, Telangana. Andhra and Telangana is a state where uh, you have to, if you are from outsider, you have to go for category C because category A is for uh, government uh, uh, colleges and the people of Andhra and Telangana domicile. Category B hoga apka management, but again for the uh, Andhra and Telangana domicile. Category C is only applicable for outsiders, and the fee structure is pretty high. And then comes uh, another state which is Rajasthan. Rajasthan is also a state where you can apply from only the third round. First round, second round, they don't allow. Only in third round in Rajasthan you can get a seat, you can procure a seat, but that also in management quota. And uh, the fee structure is pretty high and there is only, Rajasthan is the only state who only gives preference to domicile. I cite you an example, say you are securing a number of 550 and you get admitted to a particular college, say Gitanjali. Another uh, person will also have 50, with 550 marks, Rajasthan domicile, definitely he will get the chance first. So that is the main catch in Rajasthan. So. I have nearly covered uh, all the all the states and another important state which I left out, uh, I beg your pardon, that is Odisha. Odisha has got the best of dream colleges too. One is SAM, one is KIMS. SAM has got two campus. Uh, the fees of the main campus is uh, in the range of uh, 20 lakhs nearly and the new campus, the fees is in the range of 15 lakhs. KIMS is 18 lakhs 50,000. So for securing a seat in the um, uh, KIMS or SAM, you need to keep a uh, need score of at least 450 plus. Last year, uh, the competition was very high. So once again, this was a short synopsis of all the states. Jojo Log need there. Once again, all the best to the need aspirants. And uh, any queries, we are dealing with the 9 or 10 main states where the MBBS colleges are mostly located. Uh, so any queries you have regarding any MBBS counselling, be it any state in India, please get in touch with us, follow our Facebook page, follow our YouTube channel, follow our Instagram and follow us on Google. And uh, before I end this video, I would like to just give a small synopsis about Tamil Nadu, which I left. Tamil Nadu has got many deep colleges, private colleges in Tamil Nadu is uh, very tough. So. Please go aside private colleges, admissions are not possible. In Tamil Nadu, if you are opting for the deemed colleges, there are few colleges where we can minimize the fees. Okay, say for instance, a college has got a particular college has got a fees of 25 lakhs per annum. We can at least do it in 23 lakhs per annum. So for that, get in touch with that once again and all the very, very best to the need aspirants. Thank you.